Welcome back for a new review. Super Street Fighter. Round 3. The Mighty Fall. How... Whether fortunate that our paths have crossed, my friend. I only recently began cooking here to go along my duties as the master of my own dojo. It must be difficult to make time for both. There has been a slight issue in my school's environment, and rather than squander my time, I choose to offer my services to help Japanese future elite sumo wrestling, rather wrestlers, in their training. Though cooking, right? I think that you're trying to say is that you're having trouble attracting students and needed the cash. Ahem. <laughs> anyway, I believe I can help you regardless. Both Ryu and Sakura. After her pers participation Ryu finally succumbed a few years ago to Sakura's wish to train under him as his official prodigy. When she graduated high school, she postponed choosing a university and began training with Ryu at Gokin's Dojo full time. I have no idea why she ran off to Ryu when I offered to teach her the unfathomably superior techniques of the Psycho School at a generous discount, no less. What could that overrated amateur have taught her? that I, the great Dan Habiki, could not. Nothing, I tell you. In any case, maybe things would be different if she had chosen more wisely. Not too long ago, they had an unexpected visitor arrive at the dojo. What do you want, Bison? And mm, aren't you supposed to be dead? Death is a very is very relevant. I need you to come with me for a meeting, Ryu. I thought I was finished years ago. I thought this was. Contrary to what you believe, I am not here for Shadowloo. I now answer to a higher power, that of the Secret Society. The Secret Society? Even if it requires taking you by force. I got this, Master. Sakura. Don't worry, Master. If all your training hasn't prepared me enough to take out some chumps like this, 
how could I call myself your student too easy? Your next bison knows Sakura. If Bison thinks he can force me to come with him, he is welcome to try. The years have not been kind to you, Bison. You're weaker, more predictable. What makes you think you can beat me now? Mitsu... Sure you can! Go back to your foolhardy schemes and take over the world or whatever it is you occupy your time with bison. In your weakened state, you are only wasting my time. Enough. Bison, if you cannot convince him to go, allow me. Forgive me. If you gave me a little more time, silence, I tire of you. Jurin, are you the one who wants to see me? No, my superior does, so you're just another underling? Maybe I should go see this mysterious benefactor of yours and just see why he needs so many henchmen to do his dirty work. Henchmen? That wasn't smart. I am no one's henchman. You're stronger than Bison. I'll give you that, but being better than a dead man isn't saying much. Hado Kin. Nice trick. I hope you have a lot more of them. I need no tricks to crush a lonely migrel, mongrel like you. It is hopeless to challenge one who is superior to you in every way. I am the conclusion of centuries of selective breeding divinely guided by the will of the ancient secret society to create the most perfect of human beings. Maybe you could have used a few more centuries. I hope you are satisfied with landing your one lucky strike because your luck has run out. Go, Master. Show that diaper wearing freak who's boss. Often, the best way to alter a man's way of thinking is through these he cares about. In your dreams, Bison. I'm finishing what Master Ryu started. Sakura! You should have come willingly, Ryu. Now you will realize your painful mistake.
Master. Not Master. Afterward, Sakura fell into a deep depression, blaming herself for what happened to Ryu. She thought if she had been stronger, maybe things would have been different. I wonder if Sakura finally stepped to the other side. Bison, I can't believe that bastard's still alive. I may be able to help you in that regard as well. Hold on a sec. How exactly do you know all this anyway? You seem a little too familiar with the situation for someone who's just got all this second hand. Er, uh, if you must know, I was him observing Ryu from a slight obscure vintage point. You mean you were spying on him? Probably trying to cop some of his moves, right? I was there strictly for academic or rather academic reasons to see how incredibly his training techniques were compared to that of the mighty Sayoka or whatever school. I'm not going to try to pronounce it because I know I'll get incorrect. While Ryu and I have had our differences in the past, I felt compelled to follow his abductors to find out what they indeed intended to do with him. I followed them to a nearby docks and could convertly infiltrate the warehouse where they had him. There I discovered that Ryu was to be held at the warehouse until a ship arrived to transport him in a week. I returned to Sakura with this information, intending to help her with whatever she wanted to do next. I respected her wish and promised to not interfere. However, if Sakura has fallen into the lure of the Satsu no Hado, I think it is forgivable if I break that promise. If Ryu is still at the warehouse, I will surely be as well. If she believes she is ready to challenge Bison and Urine, there may still be time if we hurry. We... Though she may have chosen to follow another master, Dan Habiki never forsakes a student who has trained under the roof of the Psycho School. It's my fault, Master. You gave me the honor of being a true student, yet after so much training, I disgraced you. That secret society nut job caught you with your guard down, all because I couldn't handle a scrub like Bison. Do I need something more to ha save you? Do I need to tap into some greater power to make those who took you pay? There are techniques and knowledge 
that you told me are forbidden. The murderous underside of the techniques you've been trying to install in me. But you are these things so evil that they shouldn't be used to protect you, to protect those you love? If I used for a noble purpose, how could this power be wholly evil? What if using the Dark Auto is the only way I can save you? I knew it was you. I could feel it. Akuma. To be continued. In Super Street Fighter Volume 2, which I actually have to order. But this is the last review of Super Street Fighter Volume 1. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you all next time. Same YouTube time, same YouTube channel.